forgot, they forgot, they forgot too. Yo, what is up, YouTube? I'm about to sh give y'all. I'm about to give y'all my wish list for NBA 2K20. Feel me? Um, so first and foremost, I'm gonna talk about cools. I feel like okay. I mean, if we get to the video, what y'all know, this isn't gonna be like, you know, what I mean, this isn't gonna be one of those uh videos where it's about everything. This is gonna be like strictly my career slash part. This isn't going to be, um, you know what I mean? We're not going to talk about my team and all that other stuff. So before we get to the video, I'm going to talk about that. It's only going to be my career in part. All right, now back to the video. All right, so clothing-wise, I feel like, I'm going to try to make this fast too. I feel like we we need better clothes. Like, I feel like, you know, we. I'm not saying we should wear Gucci and Louis Vuitton and all that. But I'm saying, like, it don't even got to be name brand. Well, first off. I feel like we need shirts for every company, clothes for every company. They got Nike stuff, Jordan stuff, Under Armour stuff, but they had no Adidas stuff. I don't understand that. Um, Puma signed a deal with Nike, so I don't know if New Balances did, but they should become a brand that we could choose to wear now. So you should have Nike, Adidas, Under Armour, Jordan, and Puma. All right, so you should have those five to join. So if they do that, right, I feel like we should have shirts for everybody. There's, I don't understand why you couldn't buy Adidas shirts last year. I don't understand why you couldn't buy Adidas shirts, sweatpants, none of that stuff. I don't understand, but you could buy Under Armour. I don't get it. So, make that happen. Please give us clothes for everything. Also, I feel like we need more joggers and more sweatpants, more jeans and all that. Make the stuff fit. And make the stuff fit better, too. Like, the only stuff, I don't like the other jeans. The only jeans I like, I think they call it motto jeans, meter jeans. I really don't know what they call it. I can't remember, but... I know it started with the M jeans and they got the zippers. That's the only jean, cause it's not, it's not cause the zippers, it's the way they fit, you know what I mean? Like the other jeans, when you wear them, they fit over your shoes, you know what I mean? With, that, with those jeans, they, they kind of fit inside your shoes. So, you know, I like that look and all that. So definitely, definitely, definitely make that happen. That's a big, that's a big thing. Um, next on the list, I will talk about sneakers. And I'm not talking about just giving us more sneakers and all that. What I'm saying is, if we're signed by a brand, let us get sneakers for free. Now, we don't have to be able to go to the store and cash out like that. But players like De'Aaron Fox or um, Ben Simmons and stuff like that, they don't pay for their shoes, you know what I mean? Like, Nike and stuff will send them shoes and care packages, you know what I mean? But actually, get like shoes and hoodies and shirts and all that, and socks, all that stuff from a package from Nike. And I'm not saying, like, just give us that. But, like, I'm saying maybe after every game we play, we could pick out a shoe from Foot Locker or we get a random shoe for free after every game we play. Or maybe after every two games we play, we get a free shoe. I'm not sure. Or a free item from uh, our brand we're signed to. I'm not sure. But I can guarantee you these players is not paying for their Nike stuff. They're not doing that, bro. Now, they pay for sneakers when it comes to Gucci and Louie and all that you know, uh, content to, you know, popular belief that these athletes don't pay for anything. I don't you know where y'all getting that information from, you know, that's not true. They don't pay for a lot of stuff. They get a lot of stuff for free, like bags and all that. They'll get a lot of stuff for free, but they do pay for stuff, you know what I mean? Like, I don't, if they want a Louis Vuitton bag, they'll go buy it, you know what I mean? So, yeah. Um. Anyway, so, you know, I feel like we should definitely get stuff like that for free. That's a big fact. Um, all right, now moving on. But before we leave that, also I want more accessories. Like, can we get more? Like, can we get chains? While we still on the clothes topic, I want chains and you know, they got glasses, but more glasses. If we get some like an Apple Watch, you know what I mean? That'd be pretty hot. You know what I mean? They got nice watches now, but like Apple Watch, maybe more earrings. It's crazy how 2K14 had black diamonds, blue diamonds. And I think they had regular diamonds. And this one only had, like, you know what I mean? It's like, why? Like, I think you could, like, I don't know what. Like, why didn't they downgrade stuff? I don't understand. Also, before we get this, I got one more thing. When you win the championship in NBA 2K, you get a jacket. It says the finals. Well, when you go to the finals, you get the finals jacket. It'd be hot if we could wear the ring that we get, too. You know what I mean? 
So if I won 10 times, I could wear 10 rings. I don't know if we better wear 10 rings, but I could wear one of them out 10 rings. You get what I'm trying to say? That'd be fire. So that definitely something I would want to see in 2K. Now we moving off that. Let's go into park. I feel like we need before we get into park, my fact. I don't like the night we're not. I'm a mock career player, not a park player. I don't like that I have to damn it, you know what I mean, work so hard for something I don't understand. 2K16 was the last game where you could be a 99 overall day one. Super easy, super simple. After that, they start making shit stupid and difficult. I don't like that they did that, and I feel like they need to go back to the way it used to be. You know what I mean? I'm not feeling this new stuff, and I don't like it. So, um, I know I know why they did it, but I feel like they need to separate it and keep it how it used to be. Keep Park and my career separate, because they are two different things, and... Yeah, I mean, it's just two different things. I mean, I understand why they did it because it's the same player, but maybe give us two separate players. I don't know, man. I, I don't like that shit, dog. Because me, I'm not a part player. I'm my career player. And you know what I mean? And, like, it's just so much. It's just so much. Or at least let it be easy. Like, make it NBA. Like, you could do it, but make it, like, NBA Live. People become 99 overalls in NBA Live all the time. You know what I mean? Or at least, like, make it so, like, a 93 of 2K19 is a 99 of 2K20. You know what I mean? Like, make it easier to get there. I don't know. I just, I just, I don't feel like it's too much work, bro. I don't play video games like that, bro. I know I'm a YouTuber, so I got to, but I, it's hard for me. I get bored fast. And to me, to get 99, that's damn near impossible. Last year, I was 91. This year, I'm 91. I can't get past 91. I, I get... I played the game for like two months, you know what I mean? Not like, like, like dot like these other people, cause I got a life, you know what I mean? Not like, um, he gotta go to work, so he busy or school. No, I work from home, you know what I mean? I just don't feel like playing the game all day. I might want to chill with my girl, and just like I'm not about to be playing the game all day, bro. I get bored too. I can't play the game because I get bored of the shit. The shit is boring as hell to me. Play the game for two hours. So make the shit less hours. You know what I'm saying? Like. Nobody want to deal with that shit, dog. And that's why I never became a 92 or something. I be wanting to, but I be bored as hell. That game, this shit is not fun to me. I get bored fast. I got a low tension span. And I lose my interest. Like, they lose my interest fast and shit. So it's hard for me to play that game. Um, but anyway, there we go to that park. I, I'm not saying I want park affiliations back. But I'm saying I want different parks, if you know what I'm saying. Like, I remember last year... I was like, not last year, 2K17, you can play, you can play by yourself at park, you can play with 21. I was playing like, I was playing 21 with two other dudes. We, we was on Ridge, Ridge City, wherever it's called, with the metal rims and the metal, metal backboards and stuff like that. You know what I mean? We was playing that. And I know they tried to do it with 2K19, they tried to make it different like that. But changing the court every month is not the same fucking thing. We need different venues, you know what I mean? Like, I'm, you know what I mean? So we had Sunset Beach, we had the River, I, I don't know what it's called, but you know, we had the metal courts and all that. Two different places, you know what I mean? And it was another place too, but that's what we need. Like, let us play basketball inside, like, a rec center. Not the German rec center, because that's Pro-Am, basically. They just changed the fucking name, you know what I mean? But like, let us, you know what I mean? Play in our street clothes inside a rec center, outside, or, um, you know what I mean, like the metal place, you see what I'm saying, let us play, let us play more games by ourselves. like make 21, horse, all that stuff, but when, you, when we play horse, actually make that help us, because you can play, I think you probably could play horse now, or with like 2 get 18, you can play those type of games, but it didn't, like, make you better, I'm not sure if it gave you VC or anything, it was just for you wasting your own time, but actually make us, if we make shots, it help us out, you know what I mean? It help us our attribute bar go up. Like make it actually useful to do so we can actually yo oh, let's play horse. You know what I mean? It actually be fun. I did be fun. Also, I think we need one v one courts for part two. We need one v one courts. One v one by ourselves for free. Because let me tell you something. People people it's hard to play for money. Um it's hard to play uh, at the uh the anti up, that's what it's called, I think. Because people, like, if you a 6-3 point guard, you're not beating no 7-3 no center for real, for real. It's just not going to happen. 
So you can't have no fun. I'm not saying I have like a, a 1v1 point guard court and a 1v1 shooting guard court. That shit would be hot now I think about it. But I'm just saying, make it for free. So if we lose to a 7-3 player, we don't really care because we ain't lose no money. You know what I mean? Now we lost our record, but I don't know. You know what I mean? Anyway, I'm going to highlight at you guys in the next one. This is just, you know, a little run around. Um, I didn't, I, I ain't dropping in a minute. You know, I dropped yesterday. I'm dropping today. Uh, I'm, I'm coming back to YouTube, man. I've been, I've been grinding. I've been making money. And YouTube hasn't really been on my mind because I make so much money. Like, my money compared to on YouTube, compared to the money I'm making off YouTube is just unmatchable. It's just, like, just unmatchable. So I focus on, like, that. But I'm back on YouTube, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to try to push myself to, to keep doing this. Make sure y'all uh, like the video, dog, so I can keep dropping, man, because I need some more. I need some work on that. Make sure y'all like the video. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. If you're not already subscribed, I'm going to highlight at you guys in the next one. My name is Drip King. You can follow me on Instagram, Twitter, with those names. You know what I mean? Tweet me on Twitter. Ask me any questions. I'm out. Peace.